So in this video, I'm going to briefly explain what Mendel's findings were. So to begin with, let's get a little bit of background on Gregor Mendel. And so before Mendel, traits were thought to blend in the offspring, and so this was called blending inheritance. And so Mendel actually disproved this, and he studied peas. He, he's most famous for studying peas. And so more specifically, he studied true breeding varieties, which means that they are homozygous, or in other words, if they self-fertilize, they produce only progeny like themselves. And so what Mendel found out was that dominant traits are the traits shown in hybrids or heterozygotes. And so as you can see down here, this box right here is a heterozygote, this box right here is a heterozygote, and you can see it's a yellow color. And so yellow, in this case, is going to be the dominant trait. And then the recessive trait, as you can imagine, is a trait that's masked, or it's not shown in hybrids. And so the recessive, in this instance, would be the green color. And it's also important to remember that Mendel discovered that all the F1, which is the progeny here, so this is a parent, this is a parent, so all of the F1 progeny exhibit only one parental trait. So that means if you have a green one mated with a yellow P, um, you're not going to get like a completely different color. You're either going to get green or yellow, as you can see down here. Also, another thing you can see is that genes come in pairs. And so each parent has two copies of each gene. So one copy there, one copy there. This parent has two copies as well. They could either be the same or different. If they are the same, so up here, this parent is homozygous. If they're different, it's heterozygous. And so during reproduction, the genes will separate into reproductive cells and then the gametes will unite at random in fertilization. And so lastly, I want to uh, mention some pretty important things to take out of this video. And so alleles are the different forms of a particular gene. So either capital Y or lowercase y. And so this is an allele, this is an allele. As I mentioned before, a heterozygous genotype is when the organism has a pair of different alleles. And so this would be a heterozygous organism, this yellow P right here, with one capital Y and one lowercase y. And on the other hand, a homozygous genotype is when the organism has the same alleles. So they could either be both capital Y or both lowercase y. If they're both capital Y, the dominant trait, it's homozygous dominant. If they're both lowercase y, which is the recessive trait, they're homozygous recessive. And then finally, the genotype is the actual genetic makeup of the individual, while the pheno so in this instance, the genotype is a heterozygous organism, or a heterozygous genotype, actually. And then the phenotype of this organism would be yellow color. And so that pretty much sums it up for this video. In the next video, we're going to talk a little bit more about Mendel and um, talk about Punnett squares. But thank you for watching this video. I hope you liked it and found it useful. If you did, please be sure to give it a like and subscribe if you want to see more videos like this.